Well, it's a nice, uh, cool, it's cool, it's cloudy. I'm on the 81 heading, uh, heading south to the uh, Crooked Road country. 81's a bit hectic, um, 70 miles an hour speed limit. And, uh, you know, a lot of people are drinking and driving, so you know, it's, a, it's, a, it's a little dangerous. Actually, the only dangerous thing is, uh, is deer. Having hit a deer in Montana in uh, 2009, uh, you realize, uh, you know, there's really nothing you can do to prevent it. Uh, <laughs> they're like uh, suicidal cats running across the road. They're just, they just bound in front of your car before you even know they were there. There's not much you can do, really. Got some serious rain here in uh, the way to uh, southwest Virginia. That's where we're going, Whiteville, 56 miles away. And uh, clearly I'm not camping tonight. There's some traffic going the other way. Uh, what I'll be doing is I've made a reservation for the first time. At and I made a reservation for uh, Motel 6, 42 bucks, uh, pool and white. And it's, um, it's central to all the, uh, the Crooked Road uh, stuff that I read about. So it's a pretty beautiful country. It's a real shame that the weather is so miserable. I would have taken the Blue Ridge Parkway, but uh, what's the point? I mean, this is going to be the safest travel. Um, so anyway, signing off from the Blue Ridge Mountains of Virginia. So here we are on day two, Crooked Road. Uh, it's, uh, it's a little uh, wet, as you can see. Um, <clears throat> we're heading off. I'm heading off today to uh, Grayson County, Carroll County, and Franklin County. Uh, Franklin County is the uh, capital of Virginia, or at least it was back in the 30s. Anyway, uh, I'm looking forward to the uh, drive despite the weather, and uh, I'm motelling it instead of camping because of it. Um, I'm going to take partake, hopefully, in the Floyd County Store Jam today at 2, o 2 to 4. This is Sunday. Um, I don't know where I'm going to go today. I'm just going to follow the uh, upper reaches of what they call the Crooked Galax, Virginia, that's one place I'll be going. Um, I've got my second wind on this trip after coming here, after a kind of um, uh, disappointing uh, detour through the Delaware seashore. Uh, it was kind of a mistake. I should have just come here because I was trying to avoid this weather and of course uh, I didn't avoid it anyway. So, so I kind of wasted two days there and <clears throat> got a bit down about it. But things are looking up. I'm, uh, I had a great jam last night at uh, the uh, People's Music Store. Met Phil, 89 years old. Uh, I, uh, you know, kind of moved me the way the uh, Elvin Grass world did. At the, at the anyway, I hope to run into Bill again. He plays at a seniors' dinner on Thursday, and I'm hoping to uh, uh, attend that. And, get to play with them. More later? Well, I wish I had my camera running. <laughs> then again, I, maybe I couldn't have missed it, but a deer, I just caught out of the corner of my eye, a full-sized deer running full tilt off to my left. I'm on the Blue Ridge Parkway. Um, it's really foggy, so I saw the deer out of the corner of my eye running full tilt, uh, you know, and um, I braked as hard as I could, and the, I just missed him. He just got in front of him, just got through in front of me. Anyway, uh, God damn it, it's so easy to hit a fucking deer. You can see how bad the weather. I'm getting off the Blue Ridge Parkway. This is, uh, I, was, I took this for the scenic route, and, uh, you know, not seeing a lot. You can't see any of the vistas. There's incredible vistas on this drive. Anyway, uh, Holy fuck, just about uh, ended another trip uh, with a drastic deer accident. Anyway. <clears throat> yeah, so, uh, so there, deers.
walkers. Okay, we got a little bit of a vista here. It's so foggy today, we haven't really seen much of the spectacular scenery. We've got a car behind me. So uh, I'm not paying too much attention to what I'm filming here. But uh, it's a very, uh, very pretty country. Very friendly people. I had a jam at uh, the uh, Blue Ridge Music Center on the Blue Ridge Parkway. Uh, I don't know, just a bunch of people sitting around. Some band, I think. Uh, I think they were hired to, uh, you know, host a jam. Uh, I'm off to the Floyd uh, Floyd Country Store, where there's another jam from two to four, and I'll catch the last half of it, maybe. If I don't hit another fucking deer. <laughs> Just uh, had the Sunday afternoon jam at Floyd Country Store, and this is the town of Floyd, Virginia. Some of the musicians there. Uh, typical bluegrass jam. Way too fast for me, but uh, it was fun. I loved hearing, uh, especially the old guy singing. That was really something. His fiddle playing was. So so, there's lots of so so fiddlers around here, um, but boy, can they sing! Everybody can sing like fucking crazy. Taking 21 miles. Alrighty. Okay, dear. Got a backseat driver here. So uh, anyway, back to the Motel Six. I guess that's it for today. Had a full day driving around in the rain. Uh, I might uh, try and call Wayne Henderson tomorrow and see if uh, he's up for. Uh, a visit. He's a very famous luthier. So, uh, well, I um, got fed up with the weather, and when I left uh, Whiteville this morning, hissing rain, I just decided, you know, there comes a time in every trip when uh, you know it's time to get home. Given that home is so fucking far away, I decided why not start now. I just I got so discouraged with the rain. Now you'll notice it's fucking cleared up, of course. Um, heading south on 81. I'm gonna drive the remains of the Crooked Road today. I was gonna, I'm gonna miss out on uh, a whole bunch of cool things. Um, there's a jam tonight at the Smith County uh, something or other. And I was going to try and visit Wayne Henderson, a famous luthier, and a bunch of fiddle makers. So anyway, I feel good about, uh, I feel bad about leaving the area so soon. I plan to stay a lot longer. 